Coming to you live at Scotland, Switzerland, the women's fourth round robin game. First end, last one for Alina Petz. A draw to score three, and the draw is good. Three points on the board, first end for the Swiss. Scotland scores a two in the second. A chance for Pets to score two right back. Not a lot of room to work with. Needs to draw a side button here. But Neunschwander, Barbasat just overcooking this by a few inches. So only the single. Still a four, four to two lead for the Swiss. Fourth end for Scotland. Same line. A chance to Same draw. Even back. For the deuce. No problems there from your head. Good sweeping. Yeah, good sweeping. Yeah, good to get back to field. Eighth end. Scotland lying two. Even your head looking to navigate a uh, tight line. port here. Hanging on the corner guard. For a while, yeah. as needed. No, 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 no. Just back. curling in time, past the center guard, and right on to the forefoot for a score of three. Excellent draw. And the ninth end. Scotland putting that redstone top four, not leaving much room for Alina Pets. But she says, uh, what you can do, I can do better. This draw just pulling up in time. Gets a nudge on the red. And it's a score of two for Switzerland. Leading the game by one, coming into the 10th end. Where even your head was left a chance to win it with a draw for two. Herself. Had the backing. Only Hard needed the line. Hard curl. Hard curl. And right on to the inside of the yellow. That is two points for Scotland. And a win to stay perfect here in Helsingborg. Eve, a roller coaster of a game. How do you feel after that? Yeah, it was uh, definitely a roller coaster. It was um, obviously not a great first end, giving up a three. But I guess if there's any end you want to do that, it's the first. So you've got a bit of time to come back. And and then I think we did kind of play the scoreboard pretty well. Obviously had a chance for a two in the sixth and just didn't curl enough for me. Um, but we kept patient, managed to um, blank the seventh and get our big three in the, the eighth that I think was the turning point. And you were very good at scoring your twos throughout the game after you lost that big three. So going into that 10th end, were you happy with the scoreline? I was. I said to the girls um, before the ninth end, let's not do anything silly. Obviously, a force is ideal. Um, giving up a two is also OK, because I don't mind having the hammer coming home. Um, Melina obviously played a great shot for her two, that draw. Um, but yeah, just kept patient. And um, not ideal with everything around the centre in the last <laughs> end. But sometimes with this five rock rule, you have no choice. But you're top of the scoreboard, 4-0. and oh. You must be happy with the team's performance right now. Yeah, we have. We've been playing well, and I would say we've um, we've been building every game. Um, we still missed a few clinical shots, but um, it's definitely going in the right direction. Um, we have Sweden later on today, so it's been a tough day, or it's, so far it's been tough, and I know it's going to be very tough later. So um, we're looking forward to our game later. Thank you. Congrats. Oh, yes! Perfect.